introducing Seed VC with V2 model. You might have used RVC this is modified version of RVC where you can use one voice file to clone a voice and use it for voice calling anyone, quality of voice and how fast it can copy a voice is amazing. And good thing is you can easily install this on your computer. If you are new to my YouTube channel subscribe it and press bell icon to stay updated. Click on GitHub link in my description to go to main page of SeedVC. To install this you need Python 3.10.11, FFmpeg, Visual Studio, at least 8GB NVIDIA GPU. If your system meet minimum requirements click on code option and download main zip file. After downloading extract it where you want to install this. After extracted go inside extracted folder type cmd in folder path a new command window will open. Create venv using python 3.10. Activate venv with activation code. Now go to PyTorch main page and copy PyTorch code compatible to your CUDA version. It is important to know what CUDA version you got installed so you can choose right PyTorch. Since mine is 11.8 I will copy and paste PyTorch for 11.8 After installing PyTorch go to main folder and open requirements file. Remove all PyTorch and Torch related lines and save this file. Run requirements code. Don't mind I accidentally pressed enter button few times. After requirements installed run main code. Running it first time will download some models. After, after everything done installing seed VC GUI will launch. To easily use it again after launching make a bat file of this. Go to main folder and create new txt file. Open text file and type code as you see.
Save file as run.bat file now you can easily launch it again by double clicking bat file. After everything done seed VC GUI will launch. You also need VB cable to install. Go to VB cable main page and download latest version for Windows. Make sure you extract it in new folder. Right click on x64 exe file and run as administrator. Install then restart your computer. On GUI choose voice file you want to clone. Choose input mic as your real microphone. Output as VB cable. You don't real need to change any other settings. After done setting click on start this will download some models then start cloning. Once start cloning and streaming you will see this process on command window. To voice call for example on Skype choose your mic as VB cable. No matter what tool you use choose your microphone as VB cable. 